She left her cell phone at home. Yeah, yeah. Saturday morning, the day before Mother's Day. She don't take anything with her. She don't have her ID. She don't know how to speak English. She don't know nothing. That's why I'm worried. A young woman reports that her mother disappeared yesterday afternoon, more than 15 hours ago. All night I'm in the street looking around. I don't know what I'm going to do. The missing is Najat Lazim, a 47-year-old woman from Iraq. She moved to the United States with her daughter and son in 2009. Are you Amir? I'm Detective Brett from Missing Persons. How you doing? You know, you, know, you left at about 1 o'clock. Yeah, I left uh... I went to work. Najat's son, Amir, tells Detective Barent he works nights at a retail store. My sister called me when I was at work. And she said, my mother is not here. Is there any other relatives or neighbors that had, if she would say, listen, I need to go to the doctor, can you take me to the hospital? No, because, you know, we're like new people here. We don't know a lot of people here. Okay. You say she's been confused. Has this been for a long time or a short time? Or? Yeah, it's a long time. Actually, she's sick. Uh -huh. Your mama says her mother suffers from depression. Since she confused, like, she always cried. She always says something is not happening, you know? Do you think that uh, she would hurt herself? I don't know. I mean, your I'm thoughts, scared. only because your daughter, you would know more about what I'm mother wrote. I'm scared. I'm, I just want to, I just want to know where is she? Is she okay? She's right. cold. She's, I don't know. I don't know. I just want to, yeah. That's what I think. I'm trying to think what she what she did to be far from here. She always saying, I want to go back to my country. Home to Iraq. Yeah. Right. Yes. I know. Especially for Mother's Day tomorrow. <laughs> Hello, Nari. Concerned that Najat might be trying to fly home to Iraq, Barent sends Detective Nari Isaacson to O'Hare Airport. She does live very close to the airport, so I think it's entirely possible that she could have made it here. 